Well, brand new Fox 11 Top 11 out today on Fox11online.com. Check it out. On the boys side, West De Pere takes a tumble from second in Northeast Wisconsin down to 10th after a pair of losses last week. Brian Winchester and De Pere ranked 8th despite three losses. Facing Pulaski tonight early going. Got the steal by Jason Blom. Breaks away and drops the bomb. Big dunk. Redbirds up by two. But here comes Pulaski. Always can shoot. Taylor Splan goes splash. Red Raiders up eight after just a quarter. They're making a run here. They're one of the heroes of the state title run. Always patient. Luke Van Lannen lays it up. They go up 10. This one will go to overtime. But Pulaski gets the win 65 57. Appleton North hosting Shawano in a non conference battle in the middle of conference games. Worked out with the schedule. We join it with time running out. First quarter, Zach Suzek beats the buzzer. It's 12 10 North. But Mike Lukasevich had a good game for the Lightning. First, he steals and takes it the distance for the hoop and the harm later. Lukasevich still playing defense. Watch this. Comes in for the big block on the baseline, driving north. Gets the win 48 to 41. On the girls' side, New London up four spots to fifth in the new Fox 11 Top 11. Taking on Hortonville. First possession of the game, Lexi Rowland hits the triple. Bulldogs start the game on an 8 0 run. New London's defense has been tough. Rowland tapping away the inbound pass. Amber Pethke the land. Hortonville trying to hang. Bree Lippert drains the three. Ah, they were still down 10 at that point. Too much sharp shooting from the Bulldogs. They take it 41-24. Third ranked Notre Dame now taking on Preble. In the second quarter of this one, Triton's down one. Allie LeClaire spotting up, knocking it down. The three puts Notre Dame up two. After halftime, here comes Kayla Stangle for the Hornets. Gets the turnover. Leslie Geisler pushes back to Stangle who lays it in. They're down just one, but the fourth quarter was all Notre Dame. Eliza Campbell dishes to Kayla Borseth, who lays it in. Notre Dame gets the win this one, 50 to 35.